Every evening, millions of Australians spend their nights watching sports shows on the telly. Thanks for dinner. I didn't make your dinner. What was in the oven? I was drying my underpants. <laughs> what? This week, Justin Langer was appointed head coach of the Australian cricket team after a lengthy and dramatic summer of ball tampering and teary press conferences. I'm here today to accept my responsibility. I'm deeply sorry. <laughs> Sorry, God. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't give a shit. <laughs> yeah. 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 We're a weird, weird country, yeah. John. Yes, We've gone we to pieces because yeah. a man's rubbed a ball with sandpaper. After the dust settled on the ball tampering scandal, the nation returned to its obsession of watching grown men talk football. He's got no chair. It doesn't appear to be a chair, though. <laughs> it's to the indignity. Nothing to do with the chair, just being on that show. Why would they have a chair? The guy's got a mind. But look at those quads. You're very, very welcome. How have you been, though? In defence of whoever's job it was to organise the chairs, you wouldn't think you'd need five of the same guy on the one show. Sure, I can count above five. I mean, they are rugby league players, but... No, but they're not the producers. The producers are, have not but suffered multiple concussions. Peter Wallace held there at a dummy half and then Poochie at 5'8 just simply ran the ball like an extra back rower. Morris, who was it? Poochie and Pooey and... <laughs> What's he talking Hello. about a litter of puppies or something? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, get out your uke, John. Oh, yes, yes. It's not often Life I request that. Life is great in the sunshine state. Every Queensland heart sings this song. From the table lads to the northern strand. We're glad to say we belong. Oh, and Queensland, Queensland, Queensland. <laughs> I lived there for three years. Let me talk, John. (laughs) Didn't you used to be on this show? Yes, I was on this show. Absolutely. Not anymore. So Sam, with his girlfriend, back in 1932... (laughs) He went to an engagement party. Okay, I won't say it. Do you want me to say it? He picked up the bride-to-be and married her. He's done the groom a favour, really. <laughs> if I can beat that. Pillow Anyway, Luke is out here. He'll be here in 20 minutes or so. And it got a big laugh. <laughs> so it should have. Difficult to compete with that. You can't write that stuff. <laughs> you know what gives me the shits about this? All the work, John, all the work I put into crafting a funny story. You know, it has structure, it has punchlines, yes, like yes. three of them. And all you have to do is go out and stick your finger in your fly and the whole nation I have laughs never at done that. <laughs> Ever. This is how mental Australians are for sport. First they play the sports, then people sit around talking about sport, and then we sit around talking about them sitting around talking about the sport, and right now there are people sitting around talking about us sitting around talking about them sitting around talking about sport! Wow. Those people are insane. 